If you want to make a splash, send a mysterious tweet on a sleepy holiday weekend, like this from Bill Crystal. There will be an independent candidate, an impressive one, with a strong team and a real chance. Crystal, the staunchly anti-Trump editor of the conservative weekly Standard magazine, has been working hard to find that third-party candidate. In an email to CNN, he said an announcement is not imminent, but his tweet sure got a lot of attention, especially from Donald Trump, who responded, if dummy Bill Kristol actually does get a spoiler to run as an independent, say goodbye to the Supreme Court. CNN is told that Kristol, along with other never-Trump Republicans, have done extensive polling and gathered private data, talking to potential candidates and financial backers. There's an opening, obviously, for an independent candidate. They point to public polling as proof there is an appetite. In a survey earlier this month, little more than half of respondents 51 percent said they would be satisfied with a Trump-Clinton matchup. 44 percent said they'd want a third-party option. As for just Republicans, target voters for Crystal and other anti-Trump conservatives, 39 percent said they'd want a third-party candidate. But the open question is who? Donald Trump is a phony. A fraud. Two sources close to Mitt Romney tell CNN the 2012 GOP nominee will still not go so far as to run as an independent. Never Trump forces have also been trying to recruit Nebraska Senator Ben Sass or retired General Jim Mattis. Sass sources tell CNN he is still a no. Jim Mattis also has said thanks but no thanks. Crystal has also floated GOP Congressman Adam Kinzinger. A source familiar with Kinzinger's thinking tells CNN he would have considered it, quote, literally to save the union because both Clinton and Trump scare him. But he doesn't think the infrastructure exists to get on the ballot. On the stump, Trump mocks Crystal. He can't find anybody. What a loser. Most Republicans argue a third party run would be a disaster for the GOP, splinter the party and help elect Hillary Clinton. They could try to hijack another party and get on the ballot, but look, it's a suicide mission. Even those who are not big fans of Trump. Absolutely not. I'm going to no have third my party. say in no way, and I would advise people not to go down that road. Still, separate from Crystal's efforts, two former Republican governors, Gary Johnson and Bill Weld, won the Libertarian Party nomination this weekend, the most experienced candidates ever for that party.